Hello students. So let's try to solve one more problem of uh, CSIR net uh, June examination and uh, that was held on 16 September. The question ID is 38 and this is basically a problem from the perturbation the, uh, from obviously topic from quantum mechanics. So it is given that the third term is the perturbed term. So this is perturbation and uh, this is original Hamiltonian and uh, after putting the this particular perturbation and the perturbation is h cut omega by root under 512 exponential minus m omega square h cut square x square so the gaussian is also perturbation so what we have to do we have to calculate after the putting perturbation what will be energy of ground state so if the perturbation is not there then energy will be for the ground state will be h cut omega by 2 that is eg 0 and uh, obviously we have to go for first order perturbation so when we are going for the first order perturbation then we have to find the correction term so for the ground state so we have to calculate eg 1 and that value is nothing but uh, phi ground and uh, W is the perturbation and we have to calculate phi ground and what will be phi ground so we have to use the normalized wave function so phi ground for original Hamiltonian and this is a very non harmonic non Hamiltonian which is for the harmonic oscillator so normalize eigen function for the ground state is m omega upon pi h cut to the power 1 by 4 e to the power minus m omega x square upon 2h cut and what is w here the w is nothing but h cut omega upon root under 512 exponential minus m omega x square upon h cut so mainly we have to calculate this one and once we are going to calculate this one obviously we have to go into integration method so we will just go for integration method that value is 5g star w pi g dx obviously we have to go from minus infinity to plus infinity now this value so the whole i am just putting all constant outside the integration h omega upon 512 this is from the w and you can take this w and uh, one part of this constant from here and another from here so we have m omega upon pi h cut to the power 1 by 2 integration minus infinity to plus infinity and we have inside m omega x square upon 2 h cut this is phi g star w will be e to the power minus m omega x square h cut this is due to w and again we have to go for e to the power minus m omega x square upon 2 h cut dx so this whole integration is h cut omega upon root under 512 m omega upon pi h cut to the power 1 by 2 and this integration is always minus infinity to plus infinity e to the power minus 2m omega this and this will be 1 and again this one so 2m omega x square upon h cut dx so now the whole challenge is that how we are going to calculate this integration so this integration is very trivial one very simple one so what we can do i am just using this space to calculate this particular integration so let me remove this thing so this value is actually so if you are taking this particular thing so that is h cut omega upon root under 512 into m omega upon pi h cut to the power 1 by 2 and this integration is 2 into 1 by 2 and we have 1 upon into 1 upon 2m omega upon h cut to the power half as well as we have to for and gamma half will be also there so gamma half is also there 
so what is going to happen now look at here so gamma half is actually root pi so this root pi and pi is cancel and this 2 and 2 is cancel m omega h cut and m omega h cut half and half is cancel but they are reciprocal so this all thing is cancel so what i will get i will get h cut omega and root this root 2 will multiply with this so this will be uh, 1 0 2 4 and this is actually h cut omega upon 32 i think uh, we will get this calculation correct so this is h cut omega upon 32 but we have to calculate the complete energy eigenvalue we in this problem they are not asking what will be change in energy we have to calculate after the giving perturbation what are the energy eigenvalues so a lot of people have uh, done this uh, the final answer in writing the final answer they just got confused because this is not matching with your uh, any four option so you have to read this particular problem carefully so we have to calculate actually we have to calculate actually ground state so eg and eg is equal to eg unperturbed plus eg first order perturbation eg unperturbed is basically h cut omega by 2 and eg first order perturbation is h cut omega upon 32 and that value is equal to 17 upon 32 h cut omega and this is energy for ground state so this is uh, not very tough problem but yes in the examination pressure you have to read the problem very carefully and you have to always take care of that thing that what they ask actually so a lot of us don't just get nervous when they calculated this value is h cut omega by 32 but that is not in the four option so they thought that they have do some wrong calculation somewhere but if you will learn the question in between lines then you will find that they are asking what will be the complete ground state energy after putting the perturbation. So that will be either 17 by 32 H cut omega. Thank you.